Did he get the question right? You said if I helped you, if I... Never mind. I'll just do it myself. I'll tell Bucky to come finish him off. I'll get this other one to the shade. Presently found a great alteration in my senses. Before dark and opaque, bodies that surrounded me, impervious to my touch or sight, but now I found that I could wander at last. <laughs> With no obstacles which I could not either surmount or avoid. It's the light of the Valuable resources. Please stop. I need a doctor. Shut your squealing. Don't rock his brain too much, Jesse. Shut up, Steven Sue, and get your ass back there and give me some crackers. Help this old boy choke down this traveling agent. Who told you to stop? You don't know what you're doing. Now, what I need to do here is somehow figure out a way to make the words stop coming out of here and make the Mike Martin go in. Yeah, get that Mike Martin in there, yeah! Which one's the Mike Martin? The one that brought him here. Hold this mouth open. Yeah, let's get his jaws open, get that medicine in here. Told you we should have got some sugar for it, you know, like when we tried to get Cooter Senior to take his heartworm pill. We ain't got no crackers! Well, damn girl, get him something! I gotta get him to drink all this Mike Martin before the next thunderstorm comes up! Oh, oh, hell, Co Cooter Senior, get off that now. Ain't no dog food. That's people food. How much was that, Jesse? Where were we supposed to get two centimeters of protein if Cooter Senior done ate most of it already? Shit! I got some pickles. What the fuck some pickles gonna do, Steven Jack Bob Sue? Well, we ain't got no crackers. Jesse! Yes, Buck? Where the hell are we supposed to get two more centimeters? Paul gonna cut some hickory on me. Paul ain't gonna cut no hickory on you, baby buck. You won't even fill the bucket up and you know it, Jesse. Paul said too. I know how to count. Like I need a reason anyway. What? Here, grab her feet. No, I didn't do it! No! Damn! Oh my god! Damn! It's like... Steven Sue, go get me that Marine boy's pillow again and put it against his head. This ain't two centimeters worth of growing. He drank it all, Paul. We even fed him the girl. Hell, we fed him his own toes. And some pickles. Then why can't he make the star out of the blocks? Huh? Star test is hard, Paul. Ain't nobody got that one yet. Bullshit! You all know damn well I gotta get that damn brain two centimeters more grown to fit in Marine Boy's skull. Oh, Paul, do we really need them two centimeters? Get over here, you stupid bitch! Let me show you something. Look at here. That is two centimeters. One, two. You see that? I need a doctor. We've got 50 wasted bodies out back. 
because each and every one of you is too damn stupid to grow a brain two centimeters. You are shitting on my dreams. How is he gonna run the tiller with little bitty hands? There ain't no lightning storm coming for days. Maybe we could get a few more centimeters. I'm really sick. We ain't got time to wait. We need lightning tonight. There ain't no lightning. Clear skies, Paul. Clear skies. Full moon. Full moon. Cut up the drifter then. We'll sacrifice him to Ulthar. Bring in the thunder. Paul, if we kill the drifter, how are we supposed to get two more centimeters? More power. <laughs> <laughs> that there boy is in horrific lacking. difficulty that I remember the original air of my being. All of the events of that period appear confused and indistinct. A strange multiplicity of sensations seized me and I, I saw, felt, heard, and smelled all of same time, and it was indeed a long, long time before I learned to distinguish between the operations of my various sen senses by degrees of remembrance. Stronger light passed upon my nerves, and so, so that I was. Able 